previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Well, never said the intro, so. What's up? It's Toy Gaming here, and today we are playing Minecraft Story Mode. We are going to do most of episode 5. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell, and let's do this thing! There is a key difference between a good friend and a bad one. Good friends do what you ask. They enjoy what you make for them. They never betray you. Jesse is a perfect example of what we call a bad friend. Other bad friends include, in no particular order, Fred and Zara. Ultimately, all losers who refuse to appreciate the gifts they've been given. Now me, I won't stand for ingratitude. So I took my gifts away. Oh, but then, then, just when I thought I'd found a promising new friend... <sighs> Such a disappointment. That is when I had a brilliant idea. The perfect way to weed out the bad friends from the good. To be appreciated. I became Jesse. I was right, of course. The plan worked immediately. Jesse's good friends flocked to me. The better Jesse. <sighs> and now poor Jesse is dead, having never learned his lesson. Except he's not. <laughs> the saddest part of all, really, is that Jesse will never get to see how much better I've made Beacon Town. <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> that the admin didn't think to fortify these tunnels into town. <coughs> Speaking of fighting admins, I can't help but wish we still had Zara around. I know she was... well, she was a little much. But having an ex-admin on our side seems like it could have come in handy. I guess. She still scared me, though. She already helped us a lot. The portal buying us time to get up here. Yeah, yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah, maybe Sara's lucky being where she is right now. She's not currently marching towards a fight with the admin. I'm just glad that friends of Fred stayed at the entrance to that... that heck mouth. This is far too dangerous for them. Yeah. Jesse, when Romeo finds out what we're trying to do, we've seen what he does. I don't want to end up like Fred. I don't want Beacon Town to be like Zara's town. We've seen so many terrible things that Romeo's done. I just can't even handle thinking about that happening to the others. To our home. Yes, things look impossible, and they might be. But I believe in all of us. Look how far we've come. Look at all the impossible we've already done. We can do this. I know it seems hopeless, but we can't give up now. There are people up there counting on us, and we are not going to let them down. Hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Let's do it. Woo! My, that was loud. Hey. Here we go. No. Thank you. 
What do you guys want to bet that's where the primary terminal is? The giant floating tower with no clear entrance? Yeah, probably. We've got to find a way up there. Might be a good idea to hit the map shop. Regroup, get some supplies. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. exactly where we wanted to go. Then I guess we just can't get caught. Why exactly are we having a whole festival devoted solely to you? Do we really have to go up on stage with you in front of everyone? Enough! You two are gonna need to do a lot less talking and a lot more agreeing if, if you want to be a part up. of Beacon Town. Not so sure I do, actually. In fact, we were just about to head home. I'd be very careful if I were you guys, or there might not be a home to go back to. At all. It's just so easy for something bad to happen to a town. I like Champion City, for example. And boom! We're doomed, I'm telling you. Instead of the other one called We're Doomed, this should be We're Doomed. My? No! I had hoped there was still a chance of redeeming Romeo. Now I'm not so sure. Champion City. He blew it up. Yeah, he's a monster, through and through. And he needs to be put down. Yeah, I... I guess you're right. Now, how about you run along and get that fireworks show ready for the big keynote, eh? Yes, admin. Uh, Jesse. I think the admin's distracted. Yeah, we should grab Axel and Olivia while we have the chance. What? You were always so worried about Champion City, and now, one less thing to worry about. Okay. My... my friends and... my people? They're... gone. Psst. Olivia! Axel! Oh my gosh! I knew it! I just knew it! <gasps> Whoa, am I seeing double? Shh. Jesse, I... What is... Come on, I'll explain everything. But we have to get off the streets. To the map shop, quick. I don't know what to say. Admins? A world beneath the bedrock? Yeah, I still think he made that part up. I mean, I'm relieved that the Jesse out there isn't the real you, but... But nobody else knows that. What if everyone in Beacon Town turns on you? I mean, with what just happened outside? Axel and I almost did. I'll just have to make them understand what happened. Make them? I suppose if anyone could make them listen, it'd be you. But you said there's a way to stop this guy, right? Petra! Stella sucks even when she's on our side, but nobody deserves that. 
ever. Her whole city, gone, in an instant. Add it to the list of horrible things the admin's gonna pay for. So glad you guys are okay. Did Jesse tell you about the potato yet? The what? In the underneath, we got our hands on something called a word of passage. Hashtag potato 451. I know it sounds weird, but it's supposed to take away the admin's powers for good. Oh, I can't wait to see his face when that happens. Look at the state of my poor shop. I'm almost glad Nermi doesn't have to see the old girl looking like this. Is it even safe to hide out in here? <laughs> yeah, it used to be the safest place around. It's been ransacked once. Whoever did that might come back again. <laughs> Comforting. Getting into that tower won't be easy. Hopefully, there's still something useful in here. Everyone, take a look around. Shout if you find anything. While you guys do that, I'm gonna something? keep watch. Doing okay, Luna? <laughs> yeah, I know it's scary. We're gonna get through it, though. Poor llama. <laughs> I only do the important stuff. Does... Luna and level. This? Hey, Jack! By the tides, I'd almost forgotten about that stash. Are these? Elytra wings? Those are super rare. Yeah, got them one time when I made a trip to the end. Nothing better for gliding. What was that? Um, are we dead? You out of my sight again, Nerm. Never again. <laughs> but how did you get out of that prison? Because I broke them out. Ah! Ah! Ivor, what on earth were you just doing, hanging out up there? Jesse, I'm a ninja. Where else would I be? That is a nice outfit, Ivor. I know. Thank you. Oh, oh my, oh my gosh. Do you know who that is? That is Ivor founding freaking member of the Order of the Freaking Stone. That is a legend, standing in front of us, Nurm, within arm's reach. Hey, you're pretty legendary yourself, Jack. Just play it cool around him. Right, right, cool. Cool. I, I, I can do cool. Always. Ivor, right? Sup? Yes, I am Ivor. And you are? They call me... This... <coughs> the Stab Walker. Yeah, that's a nickname. Yes! Hi! Hello, strange stab person. Anyway, I am happy to report that your plan for the admin worked perfectly. He fell for my deception hook, line, and sinker. Story about me killing you? Big hit! You really know your audience. And after the admin's appetite for Jesse's destruction was satisfied, I returned to the prison by cover of night to free your friend from that cursed place. Between both of our enormous intellects, we figured out a simple way to disarm maximum security and escape without being blown to smithereens. It was incredibly difficult and took many, many days of intense mental activity. I can't believe that you risked your life for us. You could have died. What if Ivor hadn't gone back? <laughs> Nerm, you are a treasure. Now that the team is back together, Ivor, we need to stop the admin. We're supposed to use our... What about Radar? You can't just leave Radar out on this. He's part of the team. Word of passage at the primary terminal. 
Jesse thinks it's up in the tower. Yes. I believe that's exactly where it is. I've heard him reference such a thing several times. No one thinks to check for eavesdropping ninjas. I have learned a lot of information that way. You know about the terminal? What does it actually do? No idea! But you, the other you, spends a great deal of time within it. Just, uh... You sure we can't, like, reason with this admin guy? You know, talk it out? You? Wanting to talk it out? Jesse taught me to keep the explosions in Boomtown. That's actually not a bad idea. I could try. Right? I mean, if you could get me to talk about my feelings, it might be worth a shot. I'm formulating a plan. We just need a distraction. Maybe a distraction like Jesse's big speech at the start of JesseCon? That sounds great, but Elytra wings don't exactly go up. <laughs> they do with fireworks. Nerm, think you could get me a map of Beacon Town? Hmm. Here's the plan. Like Jack said, we need fireworks. Which the admin has stockpiled backstage at the event! Wait, isn't Stella in charge of fireworks for this thing? Perfect. We'll never get backstage without fireworks skilled uniforms. So we find Stella and she shows us where they are. I'll grab them. We suit up and boom, backstage passes. Once we're there, we swipe some fireworks. Wait, what am I doing? You're gonna be getting me a bucket of water. We'll get to that. While we're getting the fireworks, Axel and Olivia will distract the admin. Are you sure I can't just blow up the stage? Uh, that would be distracting. Axel? Then we wait until the big fireworks finale. The what? It's Romeo. I promise you, there will be a huge fireworks finale. Petra and Jack will wait in the order hall. The second those fireworks go off, I go airborne. Once I land, I use the bucket of water to create a waterfall. Oh, I was wondering what it was for. Then the three of us will head into the tower and use hashtag potato451 to strip the admin of his powers before he even knows we're here. See? A piece of cake. That uh, might just be the best crazy I've heard in a while. Jesse, this could work. Explosions, excitement, explosions. I love it. This all starts with getting Stella to help us, though. Yeah, she's pretty tight with that admin guy. Is she a friend of yours? She did seem kind of awful. You're wrong. Stella might have caused a lot of trouble in the past, but I know I got through to her in the Sunshine Institute. We can trust her. Sure hope you're right about that. Well, Stella does know where the fireworks guild uniforms are. I could follow her to them, and then we wouldn't have to talk. Great. Can I say how much I don't like this plan? You can, because you're staying here. Only Jesse stands a chance on the streets because Jesse is the admin. You don't exactly look like the you we saw earlier. You'll have to change. Jesse. I know you think Stella's on our side, but you can't trust her, okay? Be careful. I think Jesse should be more worried about the admin showing up during this plan. Good luck, friend. One serving of admin coming up. I can do this. It's time. Time to find Stella. Oh. 
there. No, that face. Oh, and there? What the? I'm following Stella. Gee. Romeo didn't touch this at least. Yeah, the cute thing I made. <laughs> cute thing I made, the memorial of Ruben. Now this looks like the <gasps> that big tower. The huge well, tower. There's my target. It actually looks <gasps> kind of good. Nah. Wait. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Jesse, dude, just unveiled the new statue you built. <laughs> yeah. It's got um character. Yeah, I kind of liked the old one, but. Whoa! Hey, I mean, you know what? This one is totally rad. I cannot keep my eyes off it. <laughs> Sha. You know what? I change my mind. Let's bring the old one back, shall we? Dude! I can't wait to see it again. Not that, you know, this one wasn't... Like, go with your gut, dude! Especially if it wants the old one back. Sha. Yeah, the tea! Righteous! Thanks, Jesse, dude! You there, Nelly, what happened to my statue? The, the one you just tore down because your gut told you to? What? What are you talking about? What is she talking about? Like two seconds ago, you, you, you were... You want to blame your insolence on me? Golems, take her away! Whoa, 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 calm yourself, dude. Like, take some deep breaths, okay? <sighs> No, 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 no. Are you all right? Oh, no. No. <gasps> Stella. Does anyone have any? Stop running from me. You're literally running from me. Stop running! You're literally running from me! Like, what the heck? Stella! I wanted one thing from you. More fireworks and banners. I'm just gonna do this. It's not my fault. I'm understaffed. Then hire more people. Oh, it made me. 
force them, conscript them, I don't care. Jesse Kahn will be the greatest thing this town has ever seen, or I will personally ensure you pay the price. Where the heck am I supposed to get more people? Bingo, that's our ticket in. It's now or never. Perfect, now we can. Oh, gravel, where are those extra Jesse banners? Oh! Stella! Jesse, back so soon. <laughs> <laughs> Since when do you... Hmm, you're not the admin, are you? Hmm? 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 It's no use hiding the truth. I am not the admin. For I am actually the real bona fide... Jesse! I knew it! Keep your voice down, all right? I am so glad you're back. Pretending to be the other Jesse's loyal servant has been exhausting. Wait, why am I just finding out now you're back? Don't you trust me, Jesse? I thought you'd move past your competitive nature with me. I am part of your core gang. I wanted to, but it wasn't safe to contact you with you being so close to the admin. Oh, you were protecting me. We are such best friends. Look, Stella, I need these uniforms to defeat the admin. I don't have time to explain all the... No problemo, friendo. Carry on with your top-secret mission. I won't spill anything to the admin. I happen to be an excellent actor. I shall get into character. Let's just, uh, separate, okay? Roger that. Exeunt stage left! Okay, that was kind of weird. And of course, as Jesse, I've got my best friends, Olivia and Axel, with me, don't I? Oh. Who are you? Yes, thanks, Jesse. We love being your best friend. Don't we, Axel? Oh, yeah, totally. The resemblance is uncanny. It's amazing. More like terrifying. What's wrong, Binta? The admin. He's right there. Right in front of me. All the suffering he's caused. Killing Fred. Inflicting sorrow on my people. He's so close. I could just charge the stage and take my justice now. Standing here idly. Seeing that smile it'd be useless there aren't any weapons that can even touch him right now our only hope is getting that word of passage up to the tower you're right attacking him now would only doom us all and as jesse you're jesse i'm glad we let's as a go to work come together to celebrate me. of course it was mandatory but i sensed that you wanted to come anyway so thank you No one permitted back here except... Fireworks Union, huh? Jeez, well, get back there then. Thank you. Now we can get to our jobs that we're totally qualified to do. Yeah, totally qualified. <sighs> I'll find a bucket and report back. Good luck. I hope you can pull this off. The... There's no fireworks. Just stuff. Come on. Who plans a convention with no fireworks? That's like planning a birthday party without... You know... uh, why can't it ever be easy? <laughs> Please. When has it ever been easy? Easy or not, I can't help but notice that we still don't have any fireworks. I guess we'll just need to make some. There has to be enough supplies to craft some paper around here. Then, 
All we need is gunpowder. And a fireworks star. Oh, that would really add some flash. We'll keep a lookout on the exits and stage. I see him backstage. Wait, Ivo? Huh? Ooh. Ivor? Shh. I'm in stealth mode. Completely undetectable to the human eye. How? Invisibility potions. You'll have to take my word for it. They're fantastic. Thanks for the back watching. Of course. It's what I'm... I do. He's watching my back all day long. Just watching my back. I think he likes it. High five. Right, you can't see it. Why do I keep forgetting that? Do you have any more? More what? Invisibility potions. Ah, uh, nope. Sadly, I drank my last one to surprise you here. But I'll be watching you. From the shadows. Ow! <laughs> you can't... You're not like a ghost even though you're invisible. Okay, at least it looks like the fireworks union guys already dropped off the fireworks stars. Which one should I take? If I recall correctly, this one will give me a super cool orange ball-shaped firework. I only did the orange one because I love orange. Okay, now... Need sugar cane. Need sugar cane. Sugar, 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 Ooh, sugar, sugar cane. Ooh, sugar cane. Stupid. Gunpowder. Perfect. Imagine you didn't get any gunpowder and you're like, what the heck we're doomed? I don't have any gunpowder. And we lose. Okay, let's get crafting. That would be just so like By the way, there was an ad. If you guys go to my second most popular video, or it's my first most popular video, there's actually ads. So, wow. mind blown. There's some good ads in there. Now there's a firework. Nice. Now just need to. Hey, Glenn! I. Wait a minute. You ain't Glenn. And you ain't who? Huh? Yeah. That felt... That felt good. Really good. Maybe we can't hurt the admin yet, but we can still take out his goons. Yeah. We've come too far to second-guess ourselves. And we can't let anyone get in our way. Maybe not quite so hard next time. Yes, right. Sorry. Ha! Huh. Not bad. Yeah, I think we She's just like, um, Olivia, or the person next to a Axel. Yeah, I think it's Olivia. We've given Binta a bit of a taste for combat. Did you get the bucket? Right here. Good luck up there. I'm going to check on my people. My people. You're welcome back here when this is over. Thank you, Jesse, for everything. Okay, all strapped in, fireworks ready. <gasps> no! Oh, no! No! 
Uh, Jesse. Uh, hey, Jesse. Yeah. Jesse, we want to talk to you more about how great it is being your friend. What if I didn't press Q? Just need to. Oh, perfect. Just what I needed. Ah! Too slow, dummy. Come at me, ugly. Uh oh. I feel bad for him. Oh, that was close. Okay, time to get the others. Boy, was I glad to see that waterfall. Yeah, we were getting kind of nervous down there. Sorry, the welcoming committee was a little strict. Come on, let's get inside. Okay, I'm not the only one that finds all this silence freaky, right? This place is dead. Definitely strange. Though I imagine you might be relieved to have a little quiet right now, huh? I was almost expecting, I don't know, another huge boss battle or something when we got in here. Yeah, the admin definitely seems to like those. But nothing. Don't be fooled, guys. If it's this quiet on our way to depower the admin, then it's gotta be a trap. Well, I'm not seeing anything trappish yet, but I'll keep an eye out. Well, would you look who it is? Wait, did they turn evil? Oh no, three people <laughs> evil? Come Wait, out and play. that's a lie. Uh, hey guys, what's going on? Stand down, oh, Ocelot. Lucas. Lucas. Looks like the tables have finally turned, huh, Jesse? We can't let you keep doing what you're doing. That's enough now. Whoa, sorry. Oh man, I am so happy to see you. I can't believe how long it's been. What are you talking about? We just talked the other day, remember? Your whole speech about how if I couldn't get in line, I could just hit the road. Now, hang on, everyone. No, it's our turn to talk. Not yours. Not anymore. I reformed the Ocelots because I wanted to remind everyone of how things were before. And most of all, I wanted to remind you. No, Because but... the Jesse I know wouldn't be running around on some power trip locking people up. Lucas. So yeah, I set your prisoners free. What are you gonna do about it? Yeah, and telling us 
our builds were ugly. Lucas, would you please stop talking for two seconds and just let me explain? Huh. And there is the new Jesse I've gotten to know lately. Everything you think I've told you since I came back from the Ice Palace was a lie. The admin locked me in a prison underground, took my identity, came back here, and pretended to be me. That is... No. How do we know this isn't a trick? No trick, friend. And it's not the first time. My friend Voss, the admin did the same thing with him. Yeah, we saw the whole thing. Is this really true? All those horrible things you did that... Okay. Yeah. It's you. Yay, we're relations! Well... We're in a relationship, I think. <laughs> well, now that we have that sorted out... What in the world are we gonna do next? Wait, why are you even in here? We're trying to get to something called the terminal. We have a word of passage. <coughs> Potato! That we can apparently use to take away the admin's powers for good. Yeah, a lot of that was way over my head, especially the potato, but I'm in. You just lead the way, and the new ocelots will have your back. Well, would you look at this. Romeo's quite the Jesse memorabilia collector. I know we don't have much time, but it might be smart to suit up properly. Agreed. Okay, you know, I want to do probably like this one. This one, but I want to... I, I love this one. Redstone riot time. I do it every time. Every, every now you time. look like you're ready for... Every single time, yep. For a showdown. Agreed. Oh, thanks, guys. Time to end this. Ocelots! Oh! Yeah! Okay, if I were a terminal, what would I look like? Why, hello there. Wasn't expecting you. Oh, crud. What's the move here, Jesse? Maybe know. you're confused, but this is my office. Ocelot, charge! charge! Excuse me? Nope, 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 nope. Big nope. Oh, that wasn't smart. Where are they? Where'd they go? Oh, I am so upset that you're back. That wannabe ninja, Ivor, told me you were dead. Hearing that made me feel great. This? This makes me feel... Ugh, bad. It's called a hustle, admin. And you fell for it, hook, line, and sinker. What better way to sneak back into Beacon Town right under your... Uh, my nose. Oh, you smug, arrogant, insignificant. What, pray tell, are you hoping to accomplish by challenging me? I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm just a touch more powerful than you. I know. That's why I'm not here to fight you. I want to talk this over. Jesse, a uh, Jesse. Ugh, talking it out? What's the point in that? That's what losers do. Real people, awesome people, settle their differences with... with... I want to talk because I know there's still good in you, Romeo. And I think that if we talk this out, maybe we can come to an understanding. You... you really think that? Yeah. I know I was all fiery and mad when you first showed up, but it's just as well. Blimey! I had no idea being you was going to be this difficult! Wait, what? Oh, yeah! I'm, I'm, I'm bloody exhausted! The, the constant whining, everyone asking for things all the time. Ugh, it's insufferable! I need iron blocks! Oh my gosh, I actually know exactly what you mean. It gets really tiring, right? Oh, yes! And it's like, hello? Uh, can I get a little me time? It's just... But it was fun at first. 
I'd show them some super amazing display of my awesome powers. They'd laugh. I'd laugh. But soon they were just asking me to do that all the time. <laughs> you, know, you know what's funny? You've made me see something. I mean, it's starting to feel like maybe I should just leave being Jesse to you. You know? <laughs> the, the, the genuine article. I'm really glad you think so, because I think that's a good idea. Oh, thanks, Jesse. I appreciate that. <sighs> well, this has all been terribly enlightening, and I, I think we've all learned some great lessons here that I will totally remember for next time. Next time? Yeah, the, the next world I build after I bedrock over yours. Oh, I'm going to get it totally right with that one. No! A whole new set of people. A whole new world. Oh, I'll be a great leader. A great friend next time around. I should thank you for all these... these wonderful little lessons you've helped me to learn. Now hang on a second, Romeo. We can still be friends. You don't have to bedrock over anything. Yeah? You... you really think so? Yes! Mm. Nah. Bedrocking time. Oh well. What do you mean, Nan? Mm. Nah. Bedrocking time. What the heck? Toodles! Oh, this doesn't seem good. Oh, you guys are okay. Yeah. He just blipped us back to the hallways again. Such a... Whew. Such a jerk. stop this how are we gonna stop this we need to take his powers away find the terminal space the roof that's where the admin keeps his portal to the terminal thing go come on we need to get to that portal before the bedrock closes up here yeah but we don't know where here is is that the clock from the admin's tower yeah <clears throat> I mean uh I uh Found the Colossus. The trip down memory lane is nice and all, but how do we find the primary terminal thingy? There is so much stuff in here. Hashtag potato 451! It was, uh, it was a good thought, but. Uh... Password protocol initiated. It's him! Oh. It's just more of his stupid recordings. You selected password protocol. Oh, it's like a automatic assistant or something. Welcome 
to terminal space. Well, shall we? So, wait. He has this whole assistant thing set up, but only he ever comes here? The automated personal assistant system was developed to aid the mighty advent... I'm not moving. I'm not moving. ...in menial tasks and help his friends navigate the terminal space. Man, so when he first made all this, he was still hoping his friends would come here too. Kind of makes me feel bad for him, actually. Nobody ever said it was easy to hang on to your friends. Oh, they're waiting for me. Wow. Is that? Please enter your password to begin a new program. I... that was all over my head. Password, password, password. That must be the word of passage. Hashtag potato451. It's... empty? Waiting for material request. I mean, it must be talking about the potato, right? Sounds right to me. Uh, potato? Please? Acquiring... Potatoes! Items dispensed. Thank you! Wait, two potatoes? Yeah, a normal one and a poisoned one. Which one do we use? I mean, the word of passage didn't say anything about poison, but it did have that weird hashtag thingy. That might mean something? Oh, I don't think that symbol ever actually means anything. Hmm. Gotta figure out which one is correct. Okay guys, I've been actually doing this for 15 minutes, and I figured I looked up what to do. Okay? And there we go. I still need to enter the rest of the word of passage. Wait, actually, I want to see- know if this is right or not till I do. I, I, I want to see what happens if I put the normal potato. Maybe this will do the trick. The answer is the poison potato, but... I just see what happens with the normal one. I still need to enter the rest of the word of passage. Won't know if this is right or not till I do. Okay, then I gotta do this. Okay, okay, that sounds like progress, right? Parrot party protocol initiated. Oh, pivot, pivot. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pivot, uh, I'm, uh, pivot, I'm guessing pivot, that's pivot, pivot. not quite right. Agreed. <laughs> Sorry, parrots. Aww. No parrots. And there we go. Was that a good thud or a bad thud? It's. Fred? Zara, hi. If you're seeing this recording, well, I guess the worst has happened. And you just put the word of passage into the primary terminal. 
I wish the terminal could just take away Romeo's admin powers. It'd be easier that way. But making this gauntlet was the best I could do. Put your hand into the pedestal to receive the gauntlet. It's got the power to make Romeo normal again. It might take a few hits to remove his powers entirely, but it'll get the job done. Do you understand? Then good luck, Sara. You're... How did you know that I said yes? I think you might need it. Well, here goes nothing. Uh, no! Do you think no way! It's, we're doomed! Dewey! What's happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo, once and for all. I Romeo, told you! grab the glove so you can't be defeated. Your world's done! No take backs! <laughs> Jesse, hurry! I beat it only once! How am I supposed to beat all of those without the gauntlet thing? Oh! What? Gauntlet delivered. Gold protocol. Well, this should come in handy. Yeah! What have you done? This is your big plan! Run directly at me! And we're gonna end it off right there because it's a cliffhanger. Because we're gonna fight the admin next time, yay! Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell, peace, yo!